Hi, it is a pre-recording this for Saturday day nine of Vlogmas because while you're watching this I will be in Anglesey celebrating the Hubster's birthday so I hope you don't mind. I've pre-recorded today's and tomorrow's just in case so that I can have a break and I'm not telling the Hubster oh hang on a minute I've just got to download this or I've just got to do that that wouldn't be fair on him so I am pre-recording. So we're going to open day nine. Let's find the fabric godmother one because the six and the nine are the same. Me and Julie, Julie sells her own clothes, opened a different one. I think that one might have something in. Can you see how confusing that is? So fabric godmother next time make sure it's make sure people know which is the six and which is the nine. Just a little tip if you're watching. Let's see. Oh yeah, this one. I think has got something in. It's got some little labels in. Fabric Godmother labels. Oh, these are special, aren't they? And they say sweater weather on the on the front. And then on the back it says Fabric Godmother. A red one and a green one. And they will definitely get used because I have got some winter woolly stuff to make and they will go great in them. Now I haven't priced up the pins from yesterday. I'm going to do a big price up on Monday. That's the other thing I'm not doing as well. Being naughty, aren't I? So yesterday was those pins, which I absolutely was chuffed to bits with. And I'm quite chuffed with these. Although, how much do a couple of labels cost? That is the question, isn't it? And I'm trying to think... I'll have to have a look because I don't buy labels very often. And these might be on the Fabric of the website and I'll be able to give a true price instead of a guesstimate. But we'll see. But yeah, they're good. They are good. So another good day from Fabric Godmother. Yesterday was stag ties. So today it's a Sam. Let me go and grab Sam's box. So because Sam and I are doing 12 days of Christmas, I am alternating stag tights, Sam gift. So today's day five of Sam's gift. Feels like buttons or something like that. Something hard. Doesn't smell of anything. She's put lots of tape on me. Let's have a scene together. Well, I'm not editing that out. I'm just all fingers and thumbs as per. Oh my goodness me. It's got me some amazing earrings. I've got some fabulous green ones. Oh, these are so big. Thank you, Sam. And then a pair. I don't know what to say. I really don't. These are hands down one of the best gifts I've opened so far. Today has been a brilliant day. Fabulous. I'm going to put these in and then I'll come back and have a chat. What do you think of those bad boys? I think these are going to be my Christmas Day earrings. Might go very well with the outfit that I'm going to wear. So, we've done the Advents, and very good they've been today too. It's been a great Advent day. So let's talk deck of the day. This one is another one for the kiddos, or the big kids in your life. Are you ready for this? It is coming. Can you guess what it is yet? It's got antlers. No, it isn't a reindeer. It is 
a little cute gift bag with reindeer ears or antlers ears. They're not ears, they're antlers, aren't they? At the top. It has drawstring. And it's one that I have adapted. I will put the link in for the drawstring bag because that isn't me. That's one that I found on YouTube. And then I put a Christine twist on it. So I've basically gone onto the internet, found a template for some antlers, put them out of double sided felt, and I interface them to make them stiff in some strong, heavy duty interfacing. And then I've appliqued all around the edge and thrown them into one side. And it creates when it's when the bag's closed the cute antler effect. So that's today's de a day. It's a great great for putting treats in. It's great to give with a gift inside if you've got a small but expensive gift for somebody. And how fun is that? So that's. Day nine's day of the day. Now, as I've said, I'm not here really. This has been done, pre-recorded. As I'm talking to you, I will be in Anglesey. So what we'll be doing today, uh, probably take the dogs for a lovely long walk on the beach, clear the cobwebs away. Then this afternoon, I want to go into Bumaris. I'll prop a picture of the lights in Bumaris because they are stunning. They have lovely Christmas lights and some gorgeous, cute little shops that I want to go and have a look for some last minute bits and bobs. And then this evening, we're going to one of our favourite restaurants. It's called Pebble Bistro in Bentler. It's only a small place, but the food is gorgeous and when I get back I'll probably give you food envy by taking some photos of what we've had to eat. So that's it for Saturday. Quick vlog today and tomorrow day 10 it will be another quick vlog because again I'm not really here but hey I'd rather do it on the day than have to pay catch up on Monday. So. I hope you don't mind that I've done a little bit of a cheat, but at least you've got your vlog on the day that it's meant to be on. I bet you're all going shopping today, aren't you? It's getting close to Christmas. Remember, it's the thought that counts, not the price of the gift. Everybody is being a little bit careful this year, and I don't think it's a bad thing myself. I think we do spend too much money at Christmas, me included. So... I'm making more handmade gifts than I've ever made before this year. And I think that they're nicer. People appreciate the work that you've gone in. Are you making any gifts? What are you making? Give me some ideas. I've got two people that I've not made a gift for and I'm feeling the pressure. And they're both men. So give me some ideas of what to make for men as not the main present, um, as like kind of a stocking filler gift. Please. Because I'm getting desperate. Anyway, enough chipper jabbering. I will see you again tomorrow for another event opening. Bye.